there are five learning objectives for TR-01. No positive and negative angles. Know the components of an angle, meaning the initial side, vertex, and terminal side. Know the standard position of an angle. Know the quadrants and their coordinate signs. Know angle labels and how we identify them in diagrams. Identify each angle as positive or negative. Please pause the video and record your answers. I'm going to reveal the answers all at once. Clockwise angles are negative, counterclockwise are positive. Identify the components of the angle. Pause and I'll reveal the answers. The initial side is the side with the angle arrow's tail, so ray O R. The vertex is pretty obviously the corner, so point O, and the terminal side has the arrow's point, so ray O S. Which is the terminal side of this angle, one or two? By the way, when the arc has no arrow, we'll assume it's a positive angle. A counterclockwise positive arc would terminate on side two. If the arc were drawn with an arrow denoting a negative angle, then the terminal side would be side one. Which is the terminal side, A or B? The terminal side has the arrow's point, so side A, and this is a negative angle. Which of these angles are in standard position? Standard position means the initial side is along the positive x-axis and the vertex is at the origin. So angles C and D are in standard position. C is a positive angle and D is negative. Identify each quadrant with its Roman numeral. Quadrant 1 is the upper right quadrant having both X and Y coordinates positive. Then the quadrants are simply numbered in sequence around the origin in the positive direction, which is counterclockwise. We'll do these one at a time. Which quadrants have positive X coordinates? 1 and 4. Which quadrants have negative Y coordinates? 3 and 4. Which quadrants have coordinate pattern negative, comma, positive? That's quadrant 2. And which quadrants have coordinate patterns positive, comma, negative? That's quadrant 4. Okay, same types of questions, but see the coordinate system in your head. Which quadrants have positive Y coordinates? 1 and 2. Which quadrants have negative X coordinates? That's 2 and 3. Which quadrants have coordinate pattern negative, comma, negative? Quadrant 3. Which quadrants have coordinate pattern positive, comma, positive? That's quadrant 1. We'll do these one at a time, too. List ways to identify the angle that contains both red circles. Angle FOD or angle DOF. List ways to identify the angle that contains the yellow circle. Angle AOD, angle DOA, or angle beta. List ways to identify the angle that's the same as theta. Angle POD or angle DOP. List ways to identify the angle that contains no circles. Angle POQ or angle QOP.